What in Spookiesville is this random doll doing out here? It almost looks like a zombie doll. I told you to stay away. Oh my god! <laughs> Holy crap, guys, it is nearing the end of October. We are in Chattanooga, Tennessee, and we are about to go into one of the last Spirit Halloweens for this whole season. That makes me very sad, but it makes me very happy that I found this spirit on my travels across the United States in my RV. Let's go in and see what kind of awesomeness lies in wait. I don't know what this used to be, but I would guess it was probably like a Sears or something. Holy crap. I don't know what we're gonna find in here, but hopefully some totally awesome stuff. And it's gonna start with inflatables. Like this super awesome, enormous guy right here. Look how huge Frankie is. This is one of my favorite inflatables they have here this year. Then of course over here we have this tall spooky guy. Bones from head to toe. And of course I see the chains of death. Let's go through the chains of death. Are you gonna scare us, chains of death? Scare us, please scare us, chains of death. The chains of death failed to scare us this time, but we're going back through anyway. Holy crap, even the floor of death is coming apart right before our very eyes. And I see a whole bunch of awesome animatronics right in front of me on the floor. Okay, let's see what they have over here. And look at this, the very first thing is the Pennywise sewer grate. Look at that, guys. You gotta love that. Look at his face. I actually think they could have done a lot better with that one, but it is what it is. And then right beside it, we have Mr. Dark. Not one, but look at this. We have two Mr. Darks, holy crap. Mr. Dark is definitely my favorite animatronic this year. I love him so much. He's so huge, he jumps up and scares the living crap out of me. Oh look, we have a couple of animated doll greeters over here, but beside her, we have another Pennywise. Okay, hold on, let's turn around the other way. There it is, another Pennywise sewer grate. That prop's not very good, it's great. <laughs> oh great, they have a third one over here. Plenty more sinister spirit dolls. All the stores seem to have a whole bunch of these. And look, we have three eight foot inflatable skeletons. Wow, this store actually does have a whole ton of animatronics, guys. We're nowhere near done yet. But first, I have to look at the awesomeness of this escalator. What could be up there? <laughs> okay, let's not get sidetracked. Look at this, we have a whole stack of jumping spiders. We have the black and red spiders. Uh, these are all black and red. Oh, but over here we have the brown ones. These are all brown. Kind of strange though, because these spiders are $99.99, where they've been $50 in all the other stores. Hmm. And look over here, we have two Harriet Hustles. She's been kind of difficult to find in the stores this year, guys, but they have two here in Chattanooga, Tennessee. Oh, and I almost missed the light up balloons, the light up Pennywise balloons. But don't go anywhere yet, because look at this, guys. We have a whole ton of things over here. But wait a minute, before we look at those, we have half a head Jack. I didn't even bother to look and see if they had any other animatronics set up. But here we have Half a Head Jack. All right, Half a Head, tell me something. Tell me what you got, Half a Head, come on. Now, I just heard you talking, I couldn't get you to shut. Oh, okay, here we go. <laughs> you gotta love Half a Head Jack. But wait, there's more over here. I noticed that there are a couple of animatronics over here. Oh, great. Hello, Barfamet. I'm glad I can't hear what you're saying because it would all be barf. But here's one that I do like. It's the scream. Is he gonna jump and scare us? I see you have your knife to gut us like a fish. But what in the world is up with this hand? Okay, mister, you're scary anyways. We'll catch you later. Oh, and down here we have Snaky Blake. Look at you, you little snaky fella. I think you deserve some stickers. All right, let's get back to the animatronics that are on the floor. Let's start over here because this is where we were earlier. And of course, we have another Snaky Blake. Hello, Mr. Snaky. Of course, right back here, we have the four foot inflatable light up eye, one eye. I must have rather map wrong with my one eye. And look at this, we have Shorty right here, but there's a 25% discount because his sound box is broken. Hmm, I wonder how difficult it would be to fix that. 
Oh well, all right, let's look over here. We have a black and red jumping spider. We have the eight foot inflatable skeleton. We have a fogging phantom. What in the world have I seen this in other stores? I think maybe one other one. He looks pretty cool. We have a ghost face here. I wonder why he's taped closed with yellow tape and a clearance sticker that says $5? What in the world? And oh my lord, look who's hiding behind them. It's the candy creep. They have a candy creep, guys. $329, how cool is that? Get down here and get it. Then on top of that, we have a flaming pumpkin and a clown toe tapper, okay. Another ghost face here. Oh, and we have another flaming pumpkin back here. More clown toe tappers here. A couple of reaper greeters. Look, we have two more fogging phantoms. They're so awesome. And then we have an experiment floor. How? Experiment four. I called him experiment floor. But look, he has a discount of 25% off because it has a broken motion sensor. Hmm, okay. Let's venture over to the side where we have another ghost face, okay? I heard you, sir. I heard you before, no talking. We have two Evelyn leeches, a Hauntress, yes! We have the Sandworm Greeter and three Sam Groundbreakers, a whole stack of flaming pumpkins and another animated doll greeter. What in the world? Now he's talking? Do it again, sir. Now he shuts up, how strange. Oh look, they have Evelyn Leech set up over here, okay. Here we go. Hello, mister. There you go again. I'm done with you, sir. Excuse me, supervisor. Could one of you take care of this fellow down here? Hmm, I'm having trouble finding the dolls. There's always at least one in each store. I think they overshot on the astronaut thing this year, though. Maybe I just don't get it, but why would there be a huge demand for astronauts this year? They do have a good collection of these hanging spookies, but I want to find the dolls. Where in the world are they? Do they have Billy Butcherson's head? No, I do not see it. And I don't see Sam's candy bar either. What a bummer. I'm still on the hunt for these dolls. I cannot believe that I can't find any of them. I cannot believe they don't have any, guys. They just must be completely sold out. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke you. A blood psycho mask? Look at that, half his nose has been sheared off. You know, it really surprises me that they don't have a Johnny Punk mask in here. Even though Johnny Punk is not the greatest thing ever, this is sort of like him. I could always buy a mask and repaint it like a Johnny Punk. But I really don't even see any that resemble him very much, like his facial features. Wait, this one is actually pretty close because he's got the tongue out. You'd have to rip off the hair. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really see any. Ooh, that's a spooky guy. That would really work for it. So maybe I'll keep it in mind for later. Oh my gosh, here's one I don't think I've ever seen. The Wrestler Pick Me Up. Look at that. It's like Nacho Libre. All right, I think that's just about it, guys. I don't see any dolls. I was hoping I would. I was hoping I would find one that I don't have yet. But uh, I guess that's it for this store. So we're going to take off. Stay tuned because we still have some more left. Halloween is not quite here yet. I told you to stay away. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> 